Hello friends, I'm Monica. Welcome to Fun Gardening. Today I'll show you all my adeniums. I'm really fond of adeniums. I have so many adenium plants and it's their blooming season. So I want to show you my plants. So let's begin with this plant. Look at the shape of the plant. It, it looks like a bouquet of flowers. All the branches coming from the growing from the codex directly how beautiful this plant and the flowers are also very beautiful these flowers grow in bunches you can see bunch of uh, flowers and the color all flowers are uh, of pink uh, color sh different shades of pink but every plant has different shape of flowers these are dark pink flowers and the shade of flowers, look at the shades and this next plant. My daughter and son gifted me this flower before, this plant sorry, before last year on my birthday. And that time this uh, plant was very small uh, plant. And now it has grown big. The main beauty uh, lies in uh, the codex of uh, Adenium plant. It is basically a desert plant. And I make my videos from uh, Jaipur, Rajasthan. And ours is a desert area. And it is a desert plant. So it grows very well in our place see the shape every plant has different shape and different size of cortex that's the beauty and the flowers are uh, amazing this is this plant is also called desert rose even some uh, flowers uh, which have more than one world they look better than they look more beautiful than uh, roses. Uh, look at these flowers. This is my 10 years old uh, plant and you can see the shape and the size of codex. Many times uh, it got uh, fungal infection and I cured uh, my plant and now it looks like a small tree. Beautiful tree. And shape of the flowers you can see different pointed petals this is my another plant look at the codex Very beautiful codex i pruned my plant in february in uh, september october and now it will grow uh, branches and these flowers are growing on very tiny branches very tiny branches in july these branches will grow big and then another it will bloom once this plant blooms in march april and second time blooms in july august adenium plants uh, need a shallow pot always grow your plant in shallow pot maximum four inch deep that will help to um, make your uh, the codex of the plant so you can see, you can look at the thickness of the codex, color of the flowers. These flowers are also growing on very tiny, very small branches. These branches will grow now and after blooming they will become big, these branches. Another type of flower, small flowers. And as it is their blooming season, they require uh, more fertilizer. Fertilize your plants during blooming season every week with uh, high potassium and phosphorus fertilizer. These flowers. This plant looks very stylish. Codex and it's growing like uh, uh, like a plant growing on the river bank. 
look at the flower it looks like more beautiful than a rose plant rose flower actually this plant my this plant has double grafting one a branch uh, produces or gives uh, pink flowers and on uh, another plant branch uh, red flowers come yellow flower yellow adenium as i said before i pruned all my adeniums in september october so the branches are very small and flowers are, flowers seems to grow directly from the main branch another pink shade very small plant another chutku adenium these are all small adeniums they'll go grow bigger uh, next season in next season and another very beautiful color in adenium with blackish uh, shade you can see the black shade dark red means blackish maroonish shade in this is my white adenium this is my white adenium and you can see the number of birds on very tiny tiny branches very small branches okay friends these were my adeniums let me know if you like my plants and if you like my video and my plants give it a thumbs up share with your friends and subscribe to my channel okay friends bye